Just below the hilt on one side of the blade is engraved a dragon. On the other side, a symbol which was believed to keep away evil spirits. This sword was used by Taoist priests in performing exorcism. This weapon is one of the oldest one in the collection, coming from the Ming Dynasty and being about 200 years old. It was used for a specific branch of martial arts known as Mu Dong, specializing in the use of swords. The hilt is made of animal horn, the scabbard of shark's skin. The blade has a bloodline running down the middle, as well as seven stars engraved on it. Also from the Ming Dynasty and about the same age as the one we've just seen is this sword which also has a beautiful agate stone in the center of the scabbard, which is made out of the skin of mackerel. It is also used for mudong, but this blade does not have the bloodline in the center. Not quite as old as the two weapons we've just seen, this sword is only about a hundred years old, or at least the scabbard is. The blade is even younger, being about 50 to 60 years old. The hilt and scabbard are made of rosewood dating back to the Qing dynasty. The name and symbol of the maker, as well as seven stars, can also be seen on the blade. Last but not least is this sword from the same period. The scabbard is made from dyed shark skin, the hilt is rosewood, and as you can see the blade is much thicker than the others we have seen, as it is a single blade. The weapon was made for general use by soldiers, guards and what have you, and as with some of the other swords we've seen, has several notches in it. A really fine collection of antique swords, not easy to come by these days.